what's the deal, man? It's your man, Cash. Get a big smoke. You already know what time it is. Your boy coming back. I'm going to go ahead and do what I do because YouTube need me. So you already know I'm coming to talk about the girl, the black girl who got killed in Walmart and your boy, Simple to Pee. We're going to start off with the Walmart. I'm going to let y'all listen to what happened. Then I'm going to get my thoughts. Walmart at the time of the hostage situation, but I can only imagine just because Christmas is only a few days away that a lot of people went inside doing some last minute Christmas shopping. Now, we do have more information about the shooting. MBI releasing a statement regarding the incident saying that one person is dead, a woman that was holding another person hostage, <coughs> one shot and killed by a Richland officer. No one else was injured. Now, this was initially reported by Richland police via their social media, saying that there was an incident at the Walmart involving a, we a weapon. The scene is secure. We're told this incident happened around 5.45 p.m. Our crew spotted the Rankin County coroner arrive on scene later in the evening. We spoke to one witness describing that scary moment walking into Walmart for Christmas shopping just before being told to leave immediately. Barely got in, people were running out, and people were screaming, get out, to me and my cousin. So, of course, we ran out, and it was just horrifying, and then we heard the gunshot. And, uh, of course, there's 15 police cars here out of this town, and I'm, and it, it's just terrifying. At this time, we do not have any more information about what led to the shooting, but again, no one else was injured. As they were hoping to get some more information about what led to this shooting, as well as the name of the person who was killed. And we also don't know if Walmart will be open today. However, I am starting to see in full. No, let me see. Uh, mm. So, basically, let me see. Police and this. Uh, Police in Mississippi shoot and kill a woman who was holding another person hostage in Walmart store as she said she needed help and demanded to speak to the news on the Mississippi Department of Public Safety said in a news release that the shooting happened Wednesday evening in Jackson, a suburb of Richmond. The person killed was a 21-year-old of West, what is this, West, oh, she was from Arkansas. Oh, she was from Arkansas, Bailey Martin said Thursday. But anyway, let me get to, let me get to the situation. The lady was killed. Apparently, she had, she had a mental problem. And, you know, my wife was reading the comments and you know i'm not a racist dude i got good white friends got good black friends i got i don't i don't got no chinese friends but I, mostly i got most of the friends are nationalities but it's crazy that a couple of white people got in the comments and said he he's not he's not shocked that this happened because black people do this all the time now my whole thing with that situation is how the fuck you gonna say black people do this all the time? Man, listen, bro. Them police did not have to kill this woman. This woman never pointed the gun at that woman. She never pointed the gun at the lady. Y'all can go and look at the uh I'm gonna put the um I'm probably gonna put the link in my in, 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 in down in the description. But she never pointed the gun at this lady at all. She never did none of that. How why did she get killed? Why is people saying, laughing and, and, and saying that's what she gets, she's supposed to get killed, and, and the white people on there in the comments saying they not shocked that this happened because basically black people do this all the time. Now let's get to the, the, the let me, let me miss, miss and match situations. So this lady got one lady hostage. She ain't point the gun at this lady. She ain't do nothing. She just was holding her. So, I mean... They, if they need to use deadly force, then they had to. It is what it is. But let's let's just go with this. How many mass shooting do white people do? 
Not even though this lady never shot this black lady didn't even shoot this lady. She just holding her hostage. White people go and shoot whole motherfucking whole goddamn uh places up. Let's go. They shoot churches up. They and not only did they shoot, they never nothing never happened. They never died in battle. Like they never like they go in there and they kill motherfuckers. They killed a whole bunch of people. The motherfucker drove and went to a grocery store and shot all them people in the grocery store. He was white. Motherfucker went in that church and killed all them people in that church. He was white. Oklahoma bombing. He was white. The motherfucker who was in Vegas shooting out the window. He was white. These motherfuckers, the kids who killing people in the school shooting all the kids. White. The people who doing all the shit, all the school shootings was white. But they say they expect it out of black people. How? We don't shoot up goddamn schools and shoot innocent people. If we do shoot in the school, we know who we coming to shoot. We shooting a person that we want to shoot. We ain't shooting other motherfuckers. Motherfucker gonna shoot who they not saying it's good. Not saying it's good to shoot motherfuckers, but niggas ain't shooting up whole schools, bro. So I'm trying to make it seem like black people just terrorize shit. When white people, and don't get me wrong, I'm saying some. Because I know good white people. It's the most ruthless killing machines in the world. And it ain't nothing that's just coming off the top of my head. History proves it. History proves it that white people is the most ruthless people to ever walk this planet. So don't get to talk about black this. I'm scared black. Nah, bro. Nah, bro. That lady had needed, she needed some help, bro. And you know what I'm saying? And I'm sorry that she ain't get it and she and she died. She died trying to get help. Cause if a motherfucker asking for help, bro, and they asking to speak to the news people, why they ain't give her the news people? Why the news people didn't come? It's something she had to say. It's something she had to say. It's something she had to say, but motherfuckers ain't give her a chance to say it. You know what I'm saying? And that's what's crazy, you know what I'm saying? Like, motherfuckers be crying out for help, but instead of them, instead of them trying to give the help, the motherfuckers, I bet the police like, I'm gonna be the first one to kill her. Let me, let me, let me get the first shot. Let me kill her. Let me, let me, let me, let me. Let me. Police, the police, the most dumbest, stupidest motherfuckers in the world. I hate police. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie. I hate the police, bro. I don't want nothing to do with them bitches. You know what I'm saying? I don't want nothing to do with them, man. I just believe that woman shouldn't have died. If, if, however y'all feel, y'all 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 hit me up, man. Let me know what y'all feel about it. What y'all feel about uh? What y'all feel about it? Go to the comments. Let me know what y'all feel in the comments. I will respond. I'm I'm gonna tell y'all how I feel. I'm gonna tell you exactly how I feel. Do not come up here with that loud phone. Yeah. Yeah. You hear my kids down there cussing and shit? Shit crazy. Motherfuckers don't got no respect for nobody. They just, they just do what they want to do. But, uh... Yeah, man, I'm going a, I'm to a, I'm a, I'm a, uh, say uh, I send my condolences to her family and, you know what I'm saying, friends and family and, you know what I'm saying, and everything else like that. Now, <clears throat> I don't know, man, too much about what happened to Sinful the P, man. I don't really know what happened to Dog. I don't know what happened to him, but what I can do, I, I, I heard, I'm going to tell y'all what I heard. I'm not going to say it happened. I ain't going to say this what happened or this what he died from. I'm going to tell y'all what I'm hearing, what people put me up on, you know what I'm saying, got to me and told me about. First, let me let me listen to a couple things. While that's doing that, uh, the thing is, I'm going to say this, though, before I let's let y'all hear the video. I came up 2015, started doing this blog in 2015. I stopped about 2000. 16, 17, I just stopped. Fuck it. I ain't want to do this shit. I'm going to do a video here and there and I'll leave it alone. But um, I came up 
saying, you know what I'm saying, off Loski, that's my little brother now, you know, Loski, that's my little bro, you know what I'm saying, I fuck with him heavy, you know what I'm saying, support everything he do, if he, you know what I'm saying, if he need my support, because it never really, I'm, I'm going to tell y'all, it never really was no beef, like, I cannot, like, why would I, I just gave my opinion what I felt, but he really put me up on game, you know what I'm saying, I, I, I used him and his platform to get a platform, right, and you know what I'm saying? Like I said, that's little bro now. I used him because I see he had a good platform. Lowski wanted to, and, and shout out to Lowski though, because Lowski one of the first niggas I ever seen doing stories, hood tales, tales from the hood, all that type of shit. Good shit. You know what I'm saying? He gave me, he gave, he gave me my blueprint. So I can't, I can't front. You know what I'm saying? We weren't gonna never kill each other over what, but uh, uh. Sinful, the P.I., he seen what I was doing at Losco. He used that to get me to get his platform. Can't be mad at him. I did the same thing to Losco that he did to me. So that definitely was a thing. But uh, my condolence to that man. But let me listen to this, and then I'm going to give you all my opinion. How I feel about what happened to Dog. Um, I want y'all to listen to this video from Sinful the P. A lot of people saying that he passed away from HIV. Some people saying he had a disease that uh <clears throat> that a lot of us didn't know about. So I'm gonna play this video and uh, apparently he's um opening up about having herpes and everything. And um like I said I don't know if he died from HIV but y'all can let me know in the comment section. Let's play the video. I guess I like that. The woman, the young woman that I had got herpes from, you know what I mean, was a, a young lady, you know what I mean, that, you know, some of y'all remember, you know what I mean, uh, in the beginning of my career, you know, I'm telling you, we do not accept any woman with a sexually transmitted disease, especially being incurable. So, uh, so fam, that pretty much was the video. <coughs> and, um, I've never heard nobody dying from hepatitis, <laughs> but, I mean, you put one and two together, you know, I'm not saying the brother had HIV, but if he did, <coughs> that would explain him losing 120 pounds, because, you know, for people who have that particular disease, Lose weight rapidly, and that's it. That's, that's it. So, uh, hit the like button. <laughs> Shit. So, I don't know if y'all can hear this. I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna uh, edit this shit because I'm gonna start editing shit. Uh, the nigga supposedly was a pimp. So, but if you a pimp, my nigga, I ain't beating up the dead because you know what I'm saying. God bless the dead. But if you a pimp, my nigga, why is you fucking these whores raw? Like, 
What is you fucking these whores? Hey, somebody check that door. Hold on. So anyway, um, yeah, yeah, ain't no reason to be fucking these whores raw. You know what I'm saying at all. You know what I'm saying, like especially you being a pimp and you know the game. Like how you doing it? How? Why? How you catching herpes? You know what I'm saying, like Dino. Did you hear me doing a video, bro? So you know, at the end of the day, at the end of the motherfucking day, you know what I'm saying. You did, you did this to yourself. You know what I'm saying. He, and then he came up. Sinful came up. I can't lie. Sinful came up. We all start off like damn the same. Lowski was at 30, 40,000 subscribers. Me and Sinful was at two, three hundred subscribers. You know what I'm saying? Then I look up Sinful at two, three thousand. Then I start asking for subscribers. Like damn man, want y'all subscribe to my page? I'm getting. I'm getting videos that's doing a hundred thousand views, but I'm I'm lacking subscribers so that I went up to a, a thousand, then I end up at two thousand. Shit, now I'm at like three thousand. But that ain't got shit on Sinful. Sinful, when I just looked at it, she's at ninety one thousand motherfucking subscribers. So he was getting he was he was actually famous. He was getting out there. Sinful was get he was getting out there. You know what I'm saying? He was doing this thing. He was definitely doing this thing, but uh, my condolence to his family, man. My condolence to that nigga family and his his people, but I ain't gonna lie. I don't know that nigga. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just, uh, I'm just doing a video on him. I ain't gonna say that I, I care. I know I may sound bad, but shit, I'm from, I, I, I just don't give a fuck. I just did it because my people, they, you know what I'm saying? I told them I'm going to get back to it. You know what I'm saying? Ain't shit else to do. Shit, I'm staying out the way. So, you know what I'm saying? I do one on them. You know what I'm saying? I was coming back for his ass, though. I ain't going to lie. I was coming back for his ass, but shit. I don't know. That nigga done fucked himself up. I don't know what the fuck he done did. I don't know what type of pussy he done got. Whatever he did. Tore that ass up. But hell yeah, man, I'm, I'm going to be trying to shoot videos back and forth, man, to y'all, man. Get y'all back into it, fucking with me, you know what I'm saying? So, it's your boy, Cash, get a big smoke, man, fuck with me.